guys welcome back to another vlog um i want to start a new vlog here it is monday this week is going to be brutal it is already feeling that way because i have the kids all to myself and i'll be their mother father caregiver driver cleaner doctor everything in for the next few days so i'll be doing it all by myself and yeah, I just wanted to bring you guys along. I picked them up from school already. That's why I'm sitting on the floor. Because I have to go through all that. Their folders, assignments, all those things. And so I'll go switch on the dining lights, please. So I've gone through it. I've seen what everybody has for the week. I've not gone through their, um, this thing. So this is how Ansar's folder comes every, every Monday. Every Monday they come with their folder. This is the folder. This is an answers folder. So every Monday they come with a folder. They bring um, the work they've done at school in the last week. And usually this, there are two teachers that they have this semester. They kind of go ahead and bring work um, sheets, you know, as the week progress progresses instead of, okay, plug it over there for me. Instead of, you know, bringing it and filling the this thing up. So I like it that way because it kind of also helps me to know what exactly they are up to, what they are doing, and how I can actually help. So when Ansar's folder comes, um, paper comes like this, this is the activity lined up for the week, their newsletter. I have to always detach this because this is for me to keep. However, this is his home homework booklet. So this week he has a lot more homework than usual. And I like it that he's also cooperating. He loves doing his, my laptop is here. He loves doing his homework. This is what he has for this week. He's writing number six, seven, eight, nine. So how I will split this up. And so, okay, thank you, Ansar. How I split this up is that he's going to do this today, Monday. Then the teacher added another work today, um, this week. So he'll do this tomorrow, Tuesday. Then on Wednesday, we will continue with the English homework um, foundations guide. So this is his foundation guide. He writes, he colors. He oh, you want to start with foundations now? Can we? Okay, so today he wants to start with um, writing first. So this is basically what it looks like. Um, he also has to do reading logs. And for his reading log, the... I have the number nine. We do reading logs as well. So I write down the books that he reads every week. For Kyria, she is in like a big kid class. So she does time test, mathematics, time test. She also has to read and she has reading challenge for the entire month. Then her teacher brings in, um, sends in this paper that I have to sign. She kind of summarizes her behavior for the previous week and um i have to sign that i've seen it if there's any issue to be addressed and sir you're showing us your bomb we don't want to see your bomb <laughs> if there's any issues to address we have to as well address it but alhamdulillah so far so good it's been impressive commentary about her her behavior her performance in class and how she's coping so yeah this is what we the week is starting as it's been very hectic <laughs> yeah it's, it's going to i see it as a it's going to be a hectic week because they are scheduled this week or for this semester or this school year it has been this thing so okay, the answer has soccer today tomorrow career has soccer on wednesday she has um, gymnastics on thursday she has soccer day two on friday she has now on friday is swimming but when she started her islamic school sunday school on sunday we discovered that there's going to be i'm sorry don't do that we discovered that there's going to be sunday then um, friday islamic um islamia as well so her dad and i are still going to i mean islam comes first and our religion comes first so we are going to be don't touch anything please we will have to we are thinking of how to adjust that schedule so that um her swimming we are going to move both of them swimming from friday to maybe saturday the thing is that there is an op opening like a window as to when you can 
sign up so and it goes very very fast very very fast so yeah her is about to start start her time test i'm setting your timer she has a time test 40 60 questions for four minutes she has to solve 60 maths question in four minutes so are you ready to start of course so start so set the timer for four minutes and let's see how well she does she's been doing well with this so and sir, let's start your own homework. Get on your chair. These are Kyria's work from last week. I don't really use it, so I put it back in the trash because house that you gather paper is the one that insect and cockroaches begin to fest and live in. So, yeah. yeah, so let's start on Sarah. This is where me and Sarah are going to set up. Yeah. And it's dark. So. And Sarah, can you raise your head up so that it can adjust, the light can adjust? Let's see. What number? What do you want to start with? Um, mm. okay, yeah, you finished. So you have to. Well, you have. Um, she she's done in two minutes. How many seconds? This, so I'm going I to, to do this go one. through all your I questions want, once I want again to do before this I one. go through. I want to do you want this to start? One. Okay, start with number six. Don't forget to write your name, and let me move my leg so that you can. Move closer. Stand up, Tashi. Tashi, Tashi, Tashi. Stand up. Write your name as always. Do you like my, do you like my name? I love your name. Do you know what your name means? Nuradin. Uh huh. Do you know what Nuradin means? Um. Light of the Dean. Light of faith. Light of faith. <laughs> so guys i'm going to let them focus i'm going to pay attention to them and i will update this vlog there's something i actually want to share with you guys so once i'm done with the kids i mama, will mama, update the vlog mama, nah. you, for, you forgot you forgot to you forgot to cook them to cook what your marshmallows uh -huh. <laughs> to make sure that this is legit i have to initial put my initials and also put the date yeah, so yeah. Have someone read to you. I'm going to read to her today. And uh, so we are done with your folder. Oh no, I'm not done with your folder. I also have to sign her report. And I've been doing a wonderful job. This is Faria's um, newsletter. But well, these are all the activities that they have that we need to also Mama. see to. Good job. So number seven is next, right? Mm -hmm. So this one is telling us that on September 15th, they have International Dot Day. This is every year. I'm used to I, all this. I so they have to wear, go to school in um, this thing, wearing t-shirts that is dotted. Or well, I have to but, buy a t-shirt online. I think I'll check for the one from last I'm, year. I need that Focus too. on your work, Nunu. Um, Fire Sub House, Spirit Night. You go, they give you discount. This one will do because I love it. No and this one is family night december all the way i'm not keeping it i'm training it because we might not go and yeah so kairia now she has an assessment next week tuesday she also has midpoint assessment on thursday wow so she um kona is in two weeks Yay! yeah so this is, and this also tells me what they are currently learning. Like she has reading. We've been doing a lot of that. Um, phonics and grammar writing. I've been doing a lot of that. Like I give her a book to read or she picks a book to read. Then she go writes about the what, the why, the when, the how of the book. Characters, events, location, and all those things, right? Solutions as well. So... Look my servant. Yeah, and the problem as well. So today was their book fair and she bought four books or so and she picked this book and I'm so proud of her. She picked this book. It's called um The Garden of My Iman. It's an Islamic book for kids, obviously, by Farhana Zia. So 
that is what we are going to be reading is a chapter book and it has about let's see 31 32 32 chapters so i'm i'm going to encourage her to read but she whatever it is that she's reading she has to follow a log pattern pick an activity and you know do it so go think about um read okay let's do this one have someone read to you okay then so that i can read this book to you right okay since you're just getting it mm -hmm. miss, so. a pen huh? miss mama yeah get a pen i think the miss pen mama. is a good job no no so continue okay you still writing <laughs> when the girl became a woman she held her own daughter on her lap a garden bloomed in dry soil she told her it was a garden of Iman. Iman, her daughter asked, it is our belief, the woman explained. The seed lies, oh, so quietly within until one day it grows into a sprout and the sprout into a sapling and the sapling into a tree and the bud arrives next to uncurl one pretty petal at a time. And a mango? Tell me about a mango, the mother begged, the daughter begged. The woman laughed. Oh, it grew, she said, and it was so soft and sweet. The golden juice dripped like a garden river, a golden river from, uh, from arm to elbow. Badi um, Amma told her, Badi Amma told this story to Amma. Who told it to me? I'm done with reading with Kyria. Now I'm going to read for Ansar, and he picked this book that he bought from the book fair today. It is called Back on Track. So I'm going to read it with him. Does he have to do a reading challenge? Yeah, he has. So guys, um, I have decided to dedicate Ansar's reading to Kyria. So that is also going to help her as well. So she's reading to Ansar over there. I want to share this. I decided to try out this culture hijab. I have been looking for one kind of hijab style like that. Let me show you guys. And I wanted to buy from Amazon, but Amazon reviews. You know Amazon can be hit or miss, right? So I, I saw it. I saw their this thing on Instagram and I decided to go check. And this is how they package. You get this picture. Of course, receipt, order receipt. I had free money on my Apple Pay, Apple Cash, so decided to use it. I didn't even exhaust it, so. So it comes in this cute muslin purse that feels like, oh, you're done? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can go upstairs and play, no tablet, please. Okay. So go and play, eh? I'll call you when it's time for dinner or if you are still going to go for soccer practice, okay? So it comes, I picked three and i was talking about the muslim bag i like it that brands for hijab brands are doing this kind of packaging you know when you're traveling you have somewhere to neatly stuff your things so this is the hijab let me wear it for you guys to see oh my goodness yeah so this one wow it's tight i wish oh my goodness i didn't know it was this tight so this is what it looks like. So the reason why I got this is because there are times when I wear clothes or I wear lots of tops or tunic tops and sometimes it's hard to really get modest outfits. The neck, you see something that you like, but it's not modest enough because of how the chest area. So I thought, oh, if I get something like this and I wear it, I can easily tuck this under and still do my veil and you know you tie this all the way to the back and you're still able to use your veil and still look good right so you see I've tied it at the back now I don't know if it's my hair that is just because it's just, they just make it really tight because it is tight but yeah this is the idea right so now it's covering my chest even though this cloth, cloth is not exposed so I can still do my hijabs. So, and I use lots of chiffon and you see, 
it's easy for me like this and it feels like non-sleep self because this veil on a normal will just be sleeping sliding down but yeah this is what i wanted to share with you guys i got it in three colors i got nude as always and coffee brown and black so yeah this is why i got this i love it i love it the it's um jersey fabric yeah it's jersey fabric but it is tight maybe it loosens up after a few washes and yeah I like it let me know what you think i'm going to link it in the description box in case the ones on amazon they looked so flimsy they looked very very flimsy so people were really saying a lot of negative review about it so that's why i did not even youtube is on but i'm not really watching anything <laughs> i'm just looking at what is going on so yeah this is where i think today's update is going to be ending sure we will update as we go i'm really tired <laughs> Hey guys so today i am all set um i need to go out i am going to ship out some suya order i have two orders to ship out i've, <coughs> I've already printed the shipping label so i'm going to be shipping by ups so after that what am i going to do again Yesterday, we couldn't go for soccer practice because it started to rain. So the mister was like, well, if it's raining, there is no point going. So today, Hairiya has soccer practice. And Ansari requested for two. He wants to eat two. So I have, I have soup in the fridge. So I'm going to go grab the soup. I need to head out of the house because I want to be at UPS before 12 o'clock so that this shipment can go out with their... 12 o'clock shipment so ship ups ship out twice in a day around 12 pm and around 5 4 5 pm so depending on how early you want your things to get to your customers try to get to this um try to get in within the earliest time frame usps however they ship only once they ship out all their stuff at all at once as far as i know and they ship out around 5 p.m that is the end of 4 p.m or 5 p.m that is the end of um day shipping so my battery is really really low even my iphone my my phone battery is low so i'm trying to like charge it a little bit then head out of the house i'm going to bring out soup from the freezer i have obono i have okra i have egusi hey thank god for bulk cooking <laughs> and thank god for your husband that does not demand for fresh soup every day I, I i won't be i wouldn't have been able to survive that kind of life so yeah um i'm going to bring out obono that is ansar's favorite and i'm going to make two for dinner so hopefully i can take um them to practice today um Kyria to soccer practice today today is tuesday and i'm already feeling tired i've been editing i uploaded a video I will, i've also edit um i've also been editing another video so i really want to even though i want to do some sit down contents right i just feel like let me just edit what i have before i film so yeah that is the update share let me go and so that I can meet time. I think I probably have 5% more charge on my on my phone. I'll manage it because my intention is to, um, is to, what am I even going to do? Just go and come back home and rest before it's time to pick the kids up from school. I'm so I just want to share something with you guys. You see, Crocs, but first of all, if you're on this channel long enough, you would know that 
I'm not a fan of Crocs, but the mister introduced me to them and I've come to love it. But you see this particular one, but it is everything. It reminds me of my secondary school, um, my senior secondary school sandal. It was this heavy. It was this, not heavy, it was this big. So, and whenever I wore my sandals back in the day, like I'll just be bouncing, feeling on top of the world. As someone that is small, I love things that are height giving or that gives height so yeah this one's my older sister my siblings don't like it they've all been teasing me since i got this however me i'm feeling my crocs i see that they have a new design i'm going to go grab that one as well me i don't mind but they are so comfortable and you know you think that one cannot even you know drive with this like you have to remove it from your legs before you can drive but fine fine when i took it she so let me go and yeah Hey fam, so you guys are not going to get the best quality this night. It is already night time and today is Thursday and today is Thursday, definitely the last day of this vlog. We are in the car because I want to go to the mailbox. Ideally, we should be at Korea's soccer practice but they cancelled because it is raining so um they cancelled yesterday we went for gymnastics and i inserted a clip today has been a very calm day they just finished we just finished studying with Korea because she has math test tomorrow they did islamia i cooked for them i made this and ground beef pasta and macaroni so yeah this is reality so I, ca I cannot come and put light for you people guys I, ca I cannot come and put light for you people i remember one of lydia stanley's video when she talked about this like lights will change so long as you're sharing realistic moments in your vlogs like light will change and light conditions will change and people should learn to live with that then because if you start trying to prep prop do all those things then your video you're not being realistic as possible wow. so yeah that is the update i have like what was i saying yeah i made pasta they ate they did islamia today is thursday today is the day they start their islamia Kyria had arabic classes she takes two arabic classes in a week thursday and friday and Sar did Nuru Bayan and and Sar did Nuru Bayan so he's done for today then tomorrow he's going to do another one I mentioned when this vlog started that Korea will also have um, school Islamic son school on Friday now so yeah it is currently 7.44 the not 7 no 7 what 724 no 724 they they are in their 90s because the drive as soon as we get back home they're going to bed i want to pick up something from the mailbox because they have dot day i ordered their dot t-shirts from amazon but they delivered it to the mailbox so i need to pick that it's raining so let me quickly go grab it okay <laughs> yeah so this is it a little bit um. <laughs> bad light oh bad light <laughs> so these are your dot day t-shirts um, because I'm, I'm not showing it to you this is it this is for Kyria and it like says what can you Create with just a dot. I can create anything. Good. A sunflower. 
make it. I, I can so, make uh, a circle. Okay, good. So this one says, uh, sorry, this one says, make your mark and see where it takes you. Dot A. I, oh, yeah, we have it. So take uh, sorry, that's yours. Uh, you made it. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. So, yeah, this has been my entire, Ooh. not my entire week, week but I mean, you guys have seen most of it. Usually, this is our schedule. No, most especially. So most. Okay, okay, okay. Not too much noise, okay? Most especially for what they have to do go to school, do homework, um, do homework, what else? Attend activities outside the house soccer swimming all those things tomorrow they have swimming and i don't think we're going to go for that swim because we have to adjust that schedule so yeah and i think this is where i want to end this vlog and i hope you guys have enjoyed this okay can i sign out before you ask me the question you cannot ask me a question when i'm trying to sign out my so yeah, I'm going to be ending the vlog here. I hope you guys have seen this realistic life to an extent. Um, I did this all by myself the entire of this week because daddy is not around and mommy had to take the reins of things. And Alhamdulillah, um, there's been no event that has, um, how would I put it, that is unexpected, that has caused us any trouble, any harm. It's been easy breezy the kids have been on their best behavior i must say and it's just a sign of how much they've grown since the last time that their dad had to travel for work and they've improved so much no stress no nothing nothing <laughs> so yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog for the opportunity time it is raining the weather is really beautiful so we are going to Beautiful. Go sleep and have a very good night rest. Yeah. I hope you. Yeah. I want to ask again. I hope you guys. Are. So if you've enjoyed this vlog, please give it a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And see you guys in my next video. We are home, so yeah, back Mama. here. What? Mama. What? Um, can you take out the sticker? Um, Game on set.